I'm Susan Leopold, and this is a piece I did called Castle, and it's based on Bannerman's Castle. It's actually an element of a larger installation of, I think there were nine pieces in the total piece, and it was originally part of an installation at the Hudson R River Museum. I wanted something that related to the museum and the Hudson River to be installed at the museum. And at the time, there was a big curved wall at the museum, and I created this panorama with photographs and mirrors. So when you walk by it, the images shift. I, years ago, I think it was 1998, kayaked out there. It was before it was open to the public, and I was with some friends, and we kayaked out there. It was so incredible that I went back again and took a camera and photographed these, uh, this abandoned structure that had, originally it was, I think it held arms and gunpowder and it burned down to the ground. So, um, but the original architect, upon this, from the Jane Bannerman, who I spoke to, who was the granddaughter of Mr. Bannerman, told me that the architect created this castle with not one 45 or 90 degree, it's all skewed angles. The whole castle is skewed angles, which worked really well because my artwork in this particular case is like a kaleidoscope where the mirrors skew all the angles. And so you kind of see different perspectives as you walk past this mirror with the photographs. And I was always fascinated by this castle because when I would drive upstate, you'd see it on this island out in the river. So that's how I first learned about the castle and then years later did a kayak trip out there and then went with my camera. So when I was invited in 2005 to do the installation here at the museum, I wanted, I'd always wanted to use those photographs. So I dug out my slides. It was before digital photography. I had 35 millimeter slides and I used those to create a whole panoramic installation with, I believe there were nine separate units. And then the Hudson River Museum, I donated one of the units for the um, piece. I love the Hudson River Museum. I was really pleased to be asked originally to, when I did my first installation, and then I was thrilled to be part of this show, Women to the Fore. And it's a great exhibition of women from Mary Cassatt to Nevelson. To, and so to be part of this group of women and such a lively show. And the museum itself, I feel is like a jewel in the New York metropolitan area that needs you know, more attention. It's a, it's a little jewel. And I always love the exhibitions.